Do you want to hear demons? Yes, I said demons. I didn't stammer. But be careful. Be forewarned. Not to misconstrue or misquote what I said. I never ever said that all of the nation's children are possessed by demons. I never said that. What I suggested was that the strange, erratic, and sometimes violent behavior, the negativity and indiscipline displayed by some of our children may I suggest, may I suggest that outside of the other internal or external factors, that some of them may be possessed by demons. And I know, I know that some of you, maybe a lot of you, wanted to say a similar thing too. But some of you didn't have the balls to say what I said. You didn't have the balls. You didn't have the intestinal fortitude to say what I said, to associate the word demon with some of our children. You prefer to write in the articles of the newspapers, although this has stimulated some discussion, or mumble among each other, or argue about it in the rum shops, in the churchyards, yes, the churchyards, or in the comfort of your homes, or even in the staff rooms of some of our primary and secondary schools. I know. Even the comedians are making fun at me. I know this is not a joke. This is not a joke. I know things. I hear things. But I have broad shoulders. I don't mind being the big bad wolf. Arrgh! For the moon or not, I have the balls for it. I can take the heat. So bring it on. Bring it on. Bring it on. Because what this little bar menace needs now, more than ever, is more balls, but less goodies. More balls and less demons. And they can quote me on that. <laughs>